You got five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Your property? Your property? Right. Five. Four. Who are you? I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. And I don't know Three. any Sams. What? Two. Okay. How is it going, everybody? My name is Jesse Guns. Bang, bang, gang, gang. Let's get back into this game. Tell me why. So, this story is very, very interesting. It seems like it's two twins that discover that they have superpowers. These twins have the power to visually see their memories play out in front of them to uncover like what really happened with their mom and their childhood in the past. So it's a really interesting story. So before I dive on in, make sure if you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Leave a like for your girl from Mr. Shemina's all this stuff and let's begin. Are you really, really sure? Huh? Oh, this is when they were little. Do it. Okay. Oh, so this is where she cut his hair. Okay, okay. I see. I think she was probably scared to okay. cut it. <laughs> I remember when I cut my hair when I was younger, I got in so much trouble. Because <laughs> I cut a big chunk in the front just to see what is would happen. Looking like Tyler already. It, it looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's I can't so sweet. Wait to show mom. Oh. She's been so sad lately. More than sad. Mm. She's been scary. Yeah, but not Aww. tonight though. It was almost like a party. <gasps> mm. At least they have each other. Me. That's that's so sweet. You don't have to thank me. You're my sister. I feel more like. Like your brother. Hmm. Brother, sister. Doesn't matter. Look out for each other. Right. But I'm um, pretty sure I just gave you a really bad haircut. <laughs> <laughs> it's all uneven. even. Look at it. <laughs> Mom? Oh, no. Mom? Oh, no. Where is she? And this is the night everything went down. Was the mom in the shed? Maybe? What happened? What happened in there? God. What is the mom doing? Is she talking to herself? Oh, she's loading a gun. Mom? <gasps> oh! Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. This is wrong. This is all wrong. Oh my god. Wait! Stop! Um, I think that any person would be running if they saw you loading up a shotgun. Oh, Tyler, I'm so sorry. I wish that we could have seen more of like what happened that night exactly. Cause she was already loading up the gun before he even came in there. Glad we found your diary. Me too. Hmm. I guess she was trying to figure out where you were at. Yeah, well, she should have asked. Hmm. It wasn't some goddamn research project. I was her child. Yeah. Hmm. About the book. Raising your transgender child? It seems like she was trying to understand. Know how rare these books were in 2005? Very. So that's probably shown the effort. To figure out how to support me? I think so. Maybe. Which she wasn't trying. She never. It doesn't make sense. I know. Yeah, I'm confused just you like you cutting are. Cutting your hair was what set her off, right? Allison, she read my diary. She already. She already knew, knew about this. It yeah. wasn't my hair, and if we were wrong about that, fuck. Mm. You think she read it? 
It's possible she never even opened the diary and that things are exactly like we always thought they were. But if she did and they right. aren't... I'm pretty sure her. that she read sure. it. I mean, we could have been wrong. But what good does it do to ask the question now? You mean other than not having to live with the thought that my mom tried to kill me for being me? Right. Tyler. He killed someone, so... I know you want so. there to be something to find. Something that'll make it all make sense. But she was unhinged. So that's it, then. I think that he she deserves the right to know. Nothing else to say. Exactly why. I think we'd be better off if we tried to move on. Why don't we talk to a few people who knew her? Mm. See if that book makes any sense to them. People don't want to talk about Marianne. <laughs> they pretend like that night never happened. Well, they need to act like it did. Because it did. His 10 years of his life going away happened to him. Like, come on. Must be nice to forget. Hmm. Must be nice to be able to forget. So, say we get our answers. And it becomes crystal clear Marianne didn't attack you because of your hair. Mm-hmm. What then? And that's we a lot to look back on. But knowing that would mean everything to me. Right. I get it. What about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend. Mm-hmm. Let's ask her about it. Sure. But I'll warn you, she's particularly touchy about this subject. What well, happened between Tessa and the me. mom? I was always her favorite. Operative word was. Oh, so not we anymore? I need to go by the store anyway. To get a few things for the repairs. Great. Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread. I'm not sure I like that analogy. Listen, <laughs> I know you don't want to keep talking about this. But you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. Yeah. So let's talk. Okay, so is there something wrong with you? You've been on edge all day. Right, what is wrong is with you? Is there something more going on with you? It's nothing. Pretty sure it's not nothing. Right. And I'd like us to be on the same page. I thought we were on the same page. I thought we were Sell too. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. It's important to me. Look, I've already explained why this is so important to me. Right. Why are you still dragging your feet? It's just with the way you avoided this place for the last three years, I thought you wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. Hmm. So that's what this is about. Maybe a little. Yeah. So he didn't come it's just, to visit for three he years. He graduated three years ago. Oh, and she's hurt by and that. This is the first time we've seen each other in person. Um, I wasn't ready to come back. It's not that I didn't want to see you. I guess she would be I hurt by that. Wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. Mm -hmm. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your fireweed graduation. Oh. I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. Mm. But you shut me out. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. Huh, okay, so now we get into the root of the problem. So the problem is that she's still holding a little bit of a grudge because Tyler wasn't trying to see her or anything once he graduated. And I don't know. I feel like that could have been brought up in the beginning instead of just throwing this slight shade the entire time. But you know, whatever, people handle things differently, I guess. Let's see, stop making, mmm. I feel like, I feel like both of these can apply. So let's see. Look, I didn't want to see anyone. I just started testosterone and, oh God. I had the <laughs> worst acne. My emotions were all over the place and the mm -hmm. smells. Allison, the smells, men smell bad. <laughs> I've dated a few. Look, I needed some time to figure my shit out before I asked anyone else to try. Mm. Does that make sense? Understandable. Yeah. yeah, it does. Understandable. So why rush the house sale? So I was thinking, hmm? do we need to be in such a rush to sell this place? We've been over this hmm. and we both agreed it's time for a clean break. I know, trust me. I'm not talking about staying for long. Right. Just long enough to get some answers. And you think this house has those answers? Maybe. Maybe not, but it's a place to start. I mean, it had that book, so... Well, it would be a shame if there was something to find and... And you didn't know. Right. How about we start digging without putting off the sale? Mm-hmm. And if it seems like we need more time, we'll talk about it then. Okay. Okay, and do we have a plan? Because we never so, said that. we have a plan? Yep. We ask around about Marianne but we also mm -hmm. stick to our repair schedule. Got That's you. That's really what you need. All right, deal. All right, let's do it. Always diary. 
Hmm. It's been a long time since okay. I heard that name. Let's open that up. Was I the only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed hmm. for a while until I settled on Tyler. Let's Most see. Most people were pretty chill about the switch. Not this says, know. Mom and Allison I argued had a again. Who refused to call me Tyler? He oh. He didn't want my help. He mm. didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, Tyler. I like the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. Okay, so now that they're done talking, I can go ahead and read this, okay? So it says, Mom and Allison argued again. At least I'm not the only one Mom is screaming at now. Mom almost seemed jealous we didn't tell her what we were planning to do in the forest. Allie thinks we should tell her about our voice. I think she knows already. My mom seemed really upset when I asked to join the hockey team. Like, it's wrong for me to play a boy sport. I'm going to keep asking. I will try again next week. She said no again. I'm so mad at her. Why does she always say no? Why does she never let me do what I want to do? Allison and I started writing a story. Well, Allison did. She didn't like it when I tried to change anything. Why can't one of the goblins be a boy goblin? Aww. Aww. I feel so sorry for him. Okay, what does this say here? This says, saw Star Wars yesterday at Bobby's place. Luke was so great, but mom found out we watched it and got so mad. She said, it gloried war. What? <laughs> Saturday, February 2005. Would mom be happier if I could do what she wanted me to? When she looks at me, she just doesn't see me. I wish I could show her. I wish I could make her understand. I think she doesn't want to. Allison told me again that it was my fault mom got angry at us. She is such a suck up. Mom's barely said anything to us in a few days. Allie said she saw her throwing away pages from the book of goblins. Aww. Do this, do that. I am sick of her voice and I am sick of that dumb name too. I'm Ollie the Goblin. Oh, Tyler. I felt for him when he said like, he doesn't think that his mom sees him, you know? View, right? I forgot how beautiful it is. Okay, let's see. We lived in our own world. We were in our own world most of the time. Mm -hmm. The lake wasn't just a lake. It was Moonhag's lair. And the mountain was an ice troll. They had a name for everything. Plus, you get used to anything if you see it every day. Not always. Hmm. Let's go I talk to her. Out right away. Already tired of the view? Just finding it hard to relax and enjoy it with so much in my mind. Right. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Need to respond to a message. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. My sister, the social butterfly. All right, who are you talking to? Oh, I wish I could have seen what was, you know, with her hand. Seems right. we got a trespasser. <laughs> oh? What the fuck? You got five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Your property? Your property? Right. Five. Four. Who are you? I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. And I don't know Three. any Sams. What? Two. Okay, Four. sir. Ellie? What are you doing out here, girl? This and is what are you house. doing? Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler, my brother. Well, your brother? Yes. Oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never. So the first thing you do is shoot. Okay. Sam, you look like a real man. Because he is a real man? So do you, Sam. <laughs> you know what I mean. I just didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. Uh, I am a man. Not a woman who looks like a man. Thank Sam. you. Correct him. A man. A real man. Just like you. Oh, shit. Are you drunk, sir? Yes, I am the asshole again. I mean, you did have a you whole gun pointed at me. Asshole, guys. I really so. don't. Come on. <laughs> you kids keep changing the rules. You can't expect us to keep up. Changing the rules? Respect the people are who they say they are. Is that so hard? hard? No, it ain't hard, but it just takes some getting used to. We'll get used to it, because we aren't going anywhere. Hey, Allison, you can't be mad, so. So... What are you doing here exactly? Oh, well, I, uh, I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? Okay. Matching the roof, checking the pipes, you know, all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Okay, introducing oh, yeah, yourself yeah, as yeah. Sam would have been cool. That's no big deal. I just, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. Mm. 
That was a shot at Tyler. Didn't you used to help Marianne with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mom had never had a man around, I, just, I took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. Oh, well, that's nice of you. How antiquated of you. Right. Thanks. I uh, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? Of course. That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since <laughs> apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh, yeah. Right. Absolutely. But, uh, selling your mother's house? Yeah. Are you sure? Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. They want to get rid of it. They got their memories. Um, a few bad memories, too. Not all. I'm sure the gun she tried to kill us with is still somewhere in there. Tyler! Mm. What? I mean, what they Tyler don't want to remember that. Is, a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. This place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. Mm hmm But maybe some good ones, too? Yes. Um, oh, ooh. Let's see. He's hammered. Let's go talk to each other without Can saying anything. Ty, we can't do this when we're in the middle of talking to someone. Okay, hey, we gotta do it quickly then. He's hammered. He's always hammered. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it'll make him chatty. Now come on. Mm -hmm. People think our family is weird enough. Oh, uh, please. Everything okay with you two? Yeah, yeah we were no. just chatting. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Um, we should go. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? Okay, let's see. Um, I have more questions. Hmm, I guess I could ask him a few more questions. Okay. Okay, there we go, so let's do it. Let's see, uh, were you too close? So let's see what we say there. How well did you know her? <laughs> Not as well as I thought. Hmm. When I heard what happened that night, well, I figured people were bullshitting me. Hmm. It really surprised you, didn't it? Much as anything ever has. Well. I wonder if he, like, Other cared for her. I saw it coming. <sighs> Not me. Hmm. Let's see. The puzzle on the door. Did you help with her door? Because that was something her to fix. <laughs> the puzzle on her bedroom door. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. You two kept sneaking in, giving her no privacy, huh? So a regular key wouldn't do? Did solve it? Yes, we did yep. today. Better late than never, I guess. Mm, never solved it myself. Hmm. I mean, not that I wanted to. I... Oh, uh, seem like you was trying to. Uh, so, uh, oh. guess you know all your mama's secrets now, huh? Well, she may have one or two left. Right. Okay, I don't think that there's anything else, so we should go. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? I think so, yeah. Um, that's it. I don't, I don't think there's anything else for us to ask. He's too wasted to be of any more help. I'll tell him to get a move on then. Okay, then go ahead. Well, we've got a supply run to make, and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so. Right. Time to get on yeah, out of here. Uh, get going, you two. Yep. Um, Sam, we all gotta get going. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, of course. You ain't gotta go I home. I got lots to do myself. I, lots of to do's on old Sam's list. Mm-hmm. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for yep, so looking uh... out for this place. <laughs> Happy to do it. I... Uh... What? Spit it out? Don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? Okay, so he's trying to help the family. Okay. I wonder if he actually had feelings for her. Sam? I don't know. Huh? Maybe. Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys... Right, oh, we need those. Yeah, of course. 
course. Yeah, they're, they're yours. I, uh, this place it meant a lot to your mother. Mm -hmm. It almost felt like it was a part of her. And it's like some part of her is alive here still. I understand. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Tyler! <laughs> uh, yeah. Jeez. Well, uh, take care of yourself. Uh, both of you. Mm-hmm. Tyler is ready to go, okay? Hey, so, we really do have a lot to do. Okay, go on. Okay. I'll be right behind you. He might look around just a little bit more to see if he can get a few answers. Maybe look back in his mom's room. Who knows? Mm, gonna look back at the picture. I thought that it was gonna give me the choice to like take it or break it, you know? I didn't know which one it was gonna make me do. This is the first time of us seeing their town, actually. Oh, he was in one of the photos. Salem. Salem. Hey, there we go. We got in there. Okay. So. Juicy. Let's see. Hey, D, just heads up. Oh, you are Sam. picking up the relief Boy, shift it. tomorrow. Okay, they spent the night in the he drunk tank again. He was arrested for public intoxication last week. And mm. That was not his first offense. He's on a bit of a downward spiral. Okay, so let's see. Okay, lost and found a set of keys. Ms. Reynolds brought a set of keys that she found lying on the ground outside of Becky's this morning. If anybody comes in looking for them, they're in the lost and found cupboard. I would have filed this properly, but that new administrative software bullshit was down all day. Okay, so that's gone. Order is shipped just between us. Season two, complete season. Okay, whatever. Hey D, are there any slides or reading material for your lecture Friday? Let's see. Okay. Oh, youth center. Yep, I'll send you my slides as soon as I get home. I'm so glad. Here's my secret for keeping kids' attention. Tales from the detox tank. Okay. All right, so we got in there. We got some information. All right, you okay, Tyler? Okay, Tyler wants that damn coffee. So let me go ahead and get to it, okay? <laughs> All right, what is this? Ooh. That's got to be a new record. Days without bear sighting. Four. So it's only been four days. Well, they are in Alaska, so, I mean, they would see it. All right, there goes the coffee, but let's look at everything else. Those are old, oh, those are old cookies that's just been sitting there. Let's go ahead and move that. There we go. Move that out of the way so that we can open up the this door. This is heavier than I expected. Girl, if you don't push that, that is not heavy. Come on now. Okay, was there anything else here? I'm can I open that? Out. Oh, why not? Why aren't we going in there? And what's up there? Check out this masterpiece. Hmm. You made it? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I glued it to the pot one day when I was bored, and nobody has bothered to peel it off. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and use this. Let's use the coffee pot. Come on. How is this so warm? We did a lot of looking you sure around. You coffee this late in the day? You'll be up all night. Mm. Uh, I don't think I'll sleep much anyways. Too much in my mind. Mm -hmm. Those dusty couches won't make it any easier. Tyler, you okay? Hey, you okay? Right, what's wrong? What are they looking at? Oh, let's go ahead and remember here. I can't do this. Hmm. Calm down, Allison. Stick to the plan. Come on, don't freak out on me now. I can't, hmm. please, I can't lie. We all lie. It's all gonna be fine, okay? Uh oh. Hmm. You okay? I don't think that they're okay. Honestly, no. Hmm. Do you ever regret? No. Oh, no way. They are not no, gonna talk about maybe that. Once or twice early on, but now, no way. Mm. I mean, look where we're at. Look where I'm at. He's like, I'm good now. Uncle Eddie's probably done by now. Hmm. We should go find him. She's wondering if he you regrets, if you know. That room for a second? Yeah. Are you sure? Let's see. Let's go inside. Now we can go in. It's the first Unlock time some more memories. That this night. is that night. Yep. 
Eddie was so uncomfortable mm. he dropped a vape. Let's see. Here. Um, have a seat. I mean, I don't know if Eddie knew what to do with the situation. Hmm. Oh! Damn it. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. Huh. They kept this? What? Hmm. It's that vase. They glued it back together. Wow. Okay, so that's the one that broke. Was there anything else here? No, I don't think there's anything else. Let's look at this. What are you looking at? Hmm. This poster. I kept staring at it that night. Oh. Like picturing myself in the forest, hunting for goblin treasure. Mm. Just wanted to be anywhere but here. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, Tyler. All right, so let's leave that. Let's leave that alone. I think they did enough exploring in this room. There's something here. Oh, let's remember that. Hmm. What happened here? Why did you separate us? Oh. Uh, Holly okay? Holly's just fine, honey. Oh, uh, no, he wasn't. We're all in the other room having cocoa. No, he wasn't. Okay. I need to ask you a few questions now. Mm. Come with me. Oh. And she was scared to go. Mm, poor baby. Huh, I don't know how. Yeah. She would deal with that. Trying to deal, but it's a lot. Trying to deal with all those memories coming back. All right, let's go up here. Hey, sorry that took so long. Yeah, we did a lot of looking around while you Sometimes was up here, sir. folks want us to come out just because they're lonely. Mm. No worries, Uncle. So hey, is he going to acknowledge Tyler? Right. Yeah, of course. Mm. How can I forget? Okay, we'll Tyler say hello Lillian. to him. Back in Delos Crossing. It's uh, good to be back. And just look at you. Hmm. A man grown. Yep, guess I ate my Wheaties. Yeah. I'm so proud of you. How you work with those kids at Fireweed. Well, thank you. I always say children are the future. <laughs> hmm. I thought that was Whitney Houston. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, bro. She stole her entire act from me. Oh, Everybody please. knows that. Look at you two. Reunited and it feels so good, huh? So he gonna keep pulling yeah. all these songs? Not sure how I got by without this dork. Look, Eddie, we are here just to say hi. Trying to get some answers, okay? We found something in Marianne's room. Things aren't really adding up anymore, and we've got questions. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah? All right. Um, what were her last days like? Did anyone mention anything about her behavior in the days leading up to mm -hmm. that day? Anything at all? Right. No. Everyone I talked to said it took them by surprise. Oh, really? Did you see her at all? Like, in those last few days? No. Hmm. I hadn't seen her for weeks. Wow. Maybe a month before. Hmm. Let's see. Marianne worried about something. Did she mention anything about us that might have been worrying her? Yeah. About Tyler in particular? No. She dealt with those kind of worries all on her own. Kept the rest she was of us very private. Own. Okay. I see. Hmm. I will tell you one thing, though. Your mom. Mm-hmm. Never knew her to hate anyone for being unconventional. Huh. Usually. So. It's the other way around. So now we're getting answers that she didn't hate Tyler because of who he was. Wow. Thanks, okay. Uncle Eddie. If you want my advice, nothing good comes from stirring up old memories. I mean, we don't really have a choice about. Yeah, that. I'm like we're getting more insight. Always a choice, son. I know sometimes it doesn't seem like it, but there is. Can we take a look at her file? Maybe. Maybe we'd see something you didn't. Mm -hmm. Her file. Her case file, her police file, whatever you call it. You right, those the file on much her. Forever, right. We do, but I can't just pull it out right here, right now. There are procedures. But you're the chief. Which makes huh. it even more He's like, let's stop BSing. That I follow procedures. Look, Chief Brown, are you going to help us? Oh. Or are you going to be a cop about Tyler. this? Tyler! Oh. No, it's fine. Tyler, I know you resent me, but Fireweed was mm -hmm. the best deal I could get you. 
I'm not mad about fireweed. He's like, I just want to know about my mom. But a little salty. You kept my sister away for seven fucking years. Ooh. That's what this is about. Ooh. Look, that was the court's recommendation. They're the experts. I just went along. Yeah, sure you did. Mm. Trust me, son. We all believed that what happened that night was self-defense. Okay. But we couldn't be sure. <laughs> I can't believe this. Look, we couldn't be sure, okay? Because they weren't we're there. To protect you both. So you still not sure? What? Oh. Oh, are you still you unsure? Sure think keeping us apart was the right call? She was traumatized. We needed each they other. They both were. And you took that away from us. So why didn't you let your sister visit when you turned 18 Uncle, then, huh? Please. Oh, it's Let's getting juicy. She's never going to tell you how much that hurt her, but it did. It is that getting juicy. Me. It wasn't about her. Allison gets that. But does she, and though? And three years is nothing compared to seven. Right, Allie? Oh, oh, man. Oh, what you going to say? Being, oh, oh, what am I going to say? Being kept apart was wrong or Eddie did his best for me. So let's see. Being kept apart was wrong. Hmm. Look, Uncle, separating us like that did not help me heal. If anything, it was the opposite. Mm -hmm. Even if he had been dangerous, I'd have taken the risk. Being apart was that miserable. Yeah. I didn't know you felt that way, little moose. Oh, that's his it little nickname. It was hard to talk to you about it. I didn't want to seem ungrateful. Mm-hmm. Look, we've all fucked up. Right. We've all hurt each other. But isn't that what family's for? Oh, she's trying to bring them together. Move on. Sounds like the right call. <laughs> but Allison, Sounds people like can't this, just uh, forget about things, you know? I wonder who you know? too. We're going to stay the night at the old house. We better mm. get going. You want to grab a bite first? It's on me. I would love to. <laughs> I want to send you out there with empty stomachs. I Tyler not said he was hungry. Down. Okay, let's go. Tyler's like, I want to look at that file. He wants to look at that file. What is that? What is that? What was that? That kind of looked creepy a little bit. Hmm. Oh? Okay, so Marianne was chasing him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh my goodness. And what is over there? That was the thing that we saw in the... Oh, oh my god. Is that what I saw in the office? In the in the police office? Oh my god. Oh, and there goes Marianne. Please, Mom. I'm sorry I cut my hair. I won't do it again. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to kill you. Oh! Please. Oh my god. This looks so bad. Oh? What? Oh. Oh, it was actually Allison. It was actually Allison that attacked the mom. Oh, wow. Allison is the one that actually did it instead of Tyler. And Tyler took the blame. I killed her. I killed her. Tyler took the blame <laughs> for his sister. For help. Oh, my I God. No, you didn't. So that's why she doesn't want to talk about it, because she's the one that actually when they did come, it. That's what we're going to tell them. Mm. No, no. Yes. We look out for each other. Oh. That's what goblins do. Oh, Tyler didn't even do anything, man. Oh my I god. It's gonna be okay. Mm. We're gonna be okay. Wow. Tyler is such a good sibling. Like, my goodness. Wow. I was not 
seeing that coming. I, I was not. I was not seeing that coming. This is these are my results. Okay, so these are my results for the choices. So Tyler and Allison. Allison was happy that Tyler accepted Eddie's peace offering. So 77% accepted the ring. Oh, some people. Oh, you could throw it in the water? Oh, wow. I didn't know you could do that. Okay. So let's see. Allison was delighted to solve the princess riddle with her brother. Oh, so 15% just bust the door down. <laughs> Tyler felt supported by Allison's trust at the store. Okay, so I, oh, so that was almost 50-50. Some people wanted to trust Alice's memory. Some people wanted to choose Tyler's memory, huh? So Tyler was reassured of his bond to Allison when she sided with him at the station. And 29% sided with Eddie. Uh-uh, I gotta side with my brother, especially if now that we know that he didn't even kill their mom. So wow. Okay, Tyler earned Sam's respect. There we go. Oh, so... Oh, so for me calling out Sam, that was the right thing to do. Okay, cool. So Tessa opened up to the twins about Marianne. I sure did. I learned the truth because I was in there snooping around. So that was good. I'm glad I chose the right choices too because I was very unsure on the second one. <laughs> um, Let's see. Eddie felt rejected by Allison when she didn't side with him at the station. So I'm so sorry, Eddie. I got to support my brother. You know, I got to I gotta support my brother. Oh, what's happening now? So what now? Well, he's obviously not going to give us the truth. Hmm. So I say we go get it ourselves. Oh, they gotta go get the Wait, files themselves. Yeah. Seriously thinking of breaking and entering a police archive. Yes. Go he big is. or go home. Mmm. So he's gonna look at the homicide files. Alright, y'all, so that is the end of episode one for Tell Me Why. So big turn of the century seems Allison is the one that actually attacked the mom and not Tyler so Tyler spent his time at fireweed for 10 years because his sister was the one that actually did it and it kind of explains now why she doesn't want to look at all the memories and everything because I was trying to figure out why she kept calling her mom Marianne and everything but that was because she was mad that she attacked her brother and she ended up stabbing her. So that's why Tyler really wants the answers. He wants to figure out why this happened and she's trying to kind of like brush it off. Maybe because she's trying to forget about it, that she actually did it, you know? And she probably still feels guilty because all the time that Tyler had to spend somewhere else and separated because of what she did, you know? So, oh man, God, I did not, I did not expect that ending, but I'm glad that I, it seems like I made the right choices so far. Well, not right, but it seems like I had a good outcome for what I did. So if you guys liked the video, make sure if you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel if you're new, leave a like on it, and I'll be back with Dang and Rampa and Horizon Zero Dawn. So I'll see you guys later, and deuces.